we have a simple block applications where we can put the post and we can assign some tags for the post we can either edit delete the post or we can add new tag or edit or delete the tags instead over here currently we are in the login section so I mean we are actually logging so I, I actually want to log out over here and just go through a series of tab over here if you go on the post you just see a list of um, posts that have been already been created by me so if you go over here then these are the list of tags that are being created by me and it's been created like few minutes ago you saw the demonstration over here uh, so if you go to post sections link actually you need to log in to create some of the post over here and also if you just want to create edit or delete the post you need to log in and also same formula applies to this tag also so currently we are not logging so it's showing some class matches we need to log in so let's go and put some passport I mean some username for it to get login so it says it's logged in so over here it's login successful okay let's go over here and take a look around the post the post that have been created if you go over here we have the blog title I mean post title and the text over here this is the text and this is the read me more sections so if you go and do some pagination there are series of blog post over here so if you go and click the read more sections then we have the particular blog post and like if you go and this is a post and and there is a some settings that can be used by the user who are being logged in inside this application and there are some of the tags that can be assigned to the post the either the post can have one or multiple tag <clears throat> so i just want to create new post by going over here if you just go over here let's type some new post so I told you that uh, we can assign one or more tags at once so I just want to choose two tags currently so I have created the post and assigned the tag as well so if you go and see the post then it seems like the tag is being assigned and the post is been created now uh, we are at, currently we are logged in so we can edit and delete this post as well so if you go to the sections then i want to add some more extra text over here uh, this is the test assignment provided by past monkey flex so and i thought that maybe i need to change this tag again so i just change the tag and if i go and look over the thing then the tag is being changed to python and debugging software so it seems like the post is being posted now if you go over here then over here also we can create a list of tag if we are log out then we can edit and delete the tag and same also rules applies to this following post so if you go then there is no success to edit and delete this is so if you go then you need to type the username to get logged in so over here also we can create some of the tag more tags have some tag uh, flags okay actually uh, what we did is that we just assigned the python uh, developing software tag to this uh, i just want to change that tag 
and let's see whether it works perfectly or not software a man so if we go to that post and see take a look oh actually it's working so it means that the tag has been edit or delete and that can be reflected that it's been reflected to the post as well so over here uh, we can also delete and edit the tag so if you see over here then it's as well as all let's see mm, let's kill it i think let's edit this one python one then it, let's see post here yeah, is been assigned and this two now and let's go and delete some of the tag what happens mm, let's I want to delete this tag so if uh, if we go and see on the post then the tag is being deleted and only one tag is being assigned to this post this seems like the post is being assigned to multiple tags and the tag can be assigned to multiple posts I mean and the post so this is a, like a few feature of this application and we also have some search mechanism over here so I actually we implemented the uh, full text search using the Woods Alchemy SQL Alchemy as an extension that is being provided for the for us so uh, in order to get to walk into it okay I haven't seen first of all I haven't deleted the post as well so I think I need to delete some of the post to show it really works. I just want to delete this post. Now the post is being deleted. Now we have only the four pages right now. So in order to work this full text, full text search maker, um, this I need to configure some of the things over in the model. So actually there is some problem if I use this extension for the full text. I hope now it looks fine so actually uh, we just implemented the full text search so the post that is been already created are not been indexed proper are not been indexed so we need to create the new post uh, so that the, we can use the full text search functionality and see how it works okay let's see mm -hmm. Put program in. Search the old good and listed over here. So we can see it uses the good text and search of the post table using the indexing and so other some other metadata information. So if you go over here then you can actually see the particular post over here i think it covers everything uh, but it's a simple application with not proper good design ui okay 